bag went viral on TikTok. So today we're gonna compare it to our crossbody. This one is definitely thinner and has that sound to it. Brevity crossbody is a lot thicker, likely because it's just made of the same materials as our backpacks. With such different materials, I wanna see how they would withstand rain. So I'm gonna use this spray bottle and then I just wrote on two index cards and we can put them in here, spray the bags and see how they do. Okay, so still dry, which is good. So moving on to straps, this bag strap is super long and adjustable, which I really like. It doesn't have a buckle, so you do have to put it all the way around you in order to wear it, but not bad. And it is on the thinner side, so beware of that. Now our brevity right here has an adjuster as well, so you can make it as big or small as you would like. And it also comes with a buckle, so it's very easy to take it on and off. It also has an elastic band down here. So when you do adjust it, you don't have this loose flap right here. All you do is bring that elastic over so it will stay secure. And lastly, let's look at the inside of these bags. I do love that they have these two little pockets right here. There's not much stretch to it, so things may fall out, but really nice to have at least some organization. Brevity right here has some organization as well. We have two pockets right here that are stretchy and mesh, so you can fit a lot in here and it will make things secure. And then on the other side, we have a larger pouch with a magnetic closure right here. So again, your things are safe and secure and actually do stay organized once you're wearing the bag. Oh, and plus there's this pocket right on the back to store anything that you want close to your body. So at the end of the day, they're both great bags. You can see why this type of bag has become so popular. However, you do see the dramatic difference between just the amount of features, the quality of the hardware, and just the quality of the overall material.